Hey guys, welcome to Deadbolt Dragons, and today we're going to be having another Pokemon unboxing. It's very exciting. And at the end of this episode, you'll actually get to see what I have in my collection. But let's get on to what we're unboxing today. Hoopa EX. Ooh. This is a very good collection box. Oh my god, I've been waiting for this for a while. This is a Christmas present of a friend. Thank you, buddy. And... Yeah, let's get into it, and at the end of this episode, we will take a look at my collection. But right now, let's unbox this bad boy. Alright guys, now we have the box off, and here are the contents, a pretty awesome looking collection. Bring it forward a bit. I mean, look at all these promos. Oh my god, all different legendary hollows. And of course, the star of the show, Hooper EX. His attacks, hyperspace ring, and wonder trick. And we've got one ancient origins, breakthrough, there's a pack behind there, I'm not sure what it is. Have a breakthrough and a roaring skies. So let's get this covering off and take a look. Okay guys, here are the contents out of the box. And that was a pretty large box. I mean look at the size of it. Some pretty cool artwork of Hooper on there. I might actually keep up. But anyway, here's everything you get with it. First start off with the uh, Hooper pen. And all the pins look absolutely fantastic. Hooper is captured in amazing detail with this pin. And obviously the back there, beautiful gold chrome. And the pin system, I'm not gonna take that off. Not a good idea. But yeah, that's the pin. Not much special about that. I'm gonna put that on my Phantom Forces box. And then I'm gonna get anything unimportant out of the way. Code card, I'm not revealing. Because that's for my friend only. Take a look at the promo before we get into the packs. Um, so, basically, star of the show, Hooper EX. Oh, looks very, very comical. He looks very devious. I know I watched the Hooper Clash of Ages movie, and Hooper was everything I expected him to be. And I really, really enjoyed that movie. Even though the card coming afterwards only appeared in it for five seconds. But that's Hooper EX. Arceus. Yeah, Arceus. Uh, good looking full art card. I will give it to them. And in Japan, there was a very small quantity set known as Legendary Shine Collection. These cards are lifted from that. Arceus in here. Hang on. His attacks are Gather Light and Judgment Blast. So that's Arceus. Latias. Or Latios. No, Latios. Latios is the boy. With the attack Skyblade and Palkia looking like a boss in the background of this. Dialga. With the attacks. Metal Claw and Time Travel. Dialga is like one of my favorite legendaries. I don't really know why. Must have something to do with the fact that he's Steel and Dragon. Heading over to Unova now. Reshiram. With the attack Slash and Repeater Blaze, I believe that says. Sorry, I'm doing this from behind the camera and it gets really difficult. So if you see me doing this, it's usually just so I can read the card. Yeah, repeat it later. Anyways, moving on. The analogue to that, White Curem. Oh, this is an awesome card. Uh, Hyper Beam and Flare Blizzard. Some of the attacks that they come out with on the cards kind of make you wish that they were actual game attacks, you know. 
let's uh, put these all together. Six promos from this collection. Give it to my friend for getting me a Christmas present. I'll give him major props, but I will put that to my Gengar box. And then we're gonna get into the packs. Now, what I said before was we have two breakthrough, we'll leave those till, oh. Well, yeah, we'll leave these two till last. And it's kind of good that one's Mewtwo X and one's Mewtwo Y in Mega Revolutions. And the other three packs we have are one Ancient Origins, one Roaring Skies, and one Primal Clash. So, let's uh, do this right. Five packs, starting off with Primal Clash. This is the Primal Clash booster box. What, boost, boost the box? Boost the pack, god damn it. But anyway, yeah, booster pack. I'll probably edit that out, maybe not. Uh, booster pack and let's hope for the best. Let's get into it. If I could do this on camera, it'd be so much easier. It is, it is easy, Woofy. You just don't know shit. Code card over there. Pack it out of the way. Let's do this. Volbeat. Sveal. Always like Sveal. Star you. Oh, I saw something. No, please don't let this be like last time, <laughs> where you just tease me all the time. Star you. Clampool. Bunnelby, aka Wonder Trade Bait. Gorbis, that can go with the Clampel. Buffalant. Rare Candy. Oh, Rare Candy. Oh, oh, oh. Reverse Hollow Wish Cash. And the uh, final card is. Holy shit! It's Kyoga EX! Full art! Oh my god! That's amazing! On the first fucking booster pack, we pull Kyoga EX. Not a primal, but it's still Kyoga EX. Now that is a fantastic start. Sorry for the glare. It's just this likes to shine up and be all metal and metallic and stuff because I can't English. Could put that right there. Put that right out there. And then we're gonna move on to the next booster. Here we go, Roaring Skies. Now let's get into this thing. I apologize for this being difficult behind the camera. Code card out of the way. Packets out of the way. It's not good. Anyways, we have a dance boss, Pidov, Ninkata, Bagan, Electric, an Ultra Ball, Toget Togetic. I keep forgetting the way to pronounce that. Wally. Ooh, Reverse Zapdos. That's pretty cool. Now that is pretty cool. Let's see what it came with. Oh, Delta Species Altaria. You know what? After the after the Kyogre pull, I don't mind at all. So that can be our regular rare. On to Ancient Origins, and guess who's on the front? It's Mega Evolved Tyranitar Tube. Please don't sue me. Please don't sue me, Tamil. I love you. I love you. I love your videos. But anyway, let's crack into this bad boy. See what we get. Packaging, out of the way. Code, out of the way. <laughs> Just fling it across the room. Three, one, two. Okay, we're on. Alamar. Baltoy. Beldum. 
Golurk, Relicant, Gloom, Tyranitar Tube, Spirit Link, Whoop Whoop, Whimsicots, Reverse Flareon, always love Flareon, not my favourite evolution, but still pretty awesome, and Gyarados, our regular rare, one of the most common rares in the set, and we've managed to pull it. But, Kyogre EX though, so Gyarados can get the fuck, but now we're on to the main event of the evening and it is scheduled for one fall, one fall, yeah that's enough of that. First off we're going to break into the Mega Mewtwo X pack of the two. And yeah, it's my actual favourite version of Mewtwo, Mega Mewtwo. Don't know why, but I just like it over Mewtwo Y, because he still has it. Anyway, I'm dawdling. Anyway, let's get into this pack, shall we? Oh, I'm hoping for at least an EX, an EX or a break card. I'd love to get a break. <laughs> That's a joke in itself. But, oh, code out of the way. One, two, three, one, two. Get out of the way. And let's get into this. Chest bin. Sorrower. Froakey. Snova. Cacmia. Snorlax. Vanillish. An assault vest. Ooh, reverse Zoroark. And the Noivern is our regular rare. I'm not doing too good after that Kyogre EX, I will have to say. Here we go. It's the final pack of this Hooper EX collection box. Let's see if we can do it and get something. No, oh, hang on. Get something as awesome as this pull right here. I doubt it, but let's see if we can do it. Kyogre EX, you're an awesome card, but let's see if we can get something from the most recent set breakthrough. I'd love to get a break card, even if I don't get an EX. This will be awesome. Get packaging out of the way. Code card out of the way. One, two, three. Do this. Spritzy. Ghastly. Doduo. Power of Slide Gen 1 in here. Star you. Star me. One after the other. Oh, that's insane. Skyler. Spupa. Reverse Paris. Oh, it looks alright, actually. Put that over in my reverse pile. And then Simipore. Oh, a very disappointing end to this box. But it's all good in the hood. Okay, so that was a pretty disappointing box, apart from the Kyogre EX, which was very well appreciated, and the six promos that came with the box. But I did promise at the start of the video that we'd go over what I have in my rares and hollows. Um, I'm going to skip the regular rares because they're not quite that exciting. So we'll go through everything I have, and we'll start off with the star of today's program, Kyoga EX Full Art. Love it. It's in a top loader, because he was more worthy than Minectric EX Full Art. I'm sure you remember the Mega Rayquaza EX that we pulled in the last unboxing video? Giratina EX. Funny story about this. Game, the game store in my in like my local game store, they had a random pack that had this in. So I snapped it up and was surprised when I found this in it, and I thought that was a very good investment. Hooper EX. Arceus Full Art. Arceus, Arceus, whichever way you decide to say it, I don't mind. 
Latios, yes, definitely the boy. Dialga, full art. Reshiram, full art. White Kyurem, full art. Kyurem or Kyurem, either way. I'm sure you all remember the Mega Glalie EX that we pulled in the last unboxing. Looking all fancy fancy. Tyrantrum EX, because a while back I did get a Tyrantrum EX box, and but at that time I was not doing Pokemon unboxings on this channel, so I didn't film it. But yeah, there's the Tyrantrum EX promo. Mega Agron EX. Mega Charizard Y EX. Now that looks absolutely baller. Yes, they all have different sleeves because they were what was available to me. Malamar EX. Gallade EX. This was a promo from another box. Um, Gallade EX box, I believe. That came with a jumbo promo and all that jazz. Just like the Mega Mewtwo X box that we looked over the last unboxing. Mega, well, not Mega Sceptile, but Sceptile EX. Looking all fancy. Team Flare Gear, the jamming net. That's it for the EXs and Flare Gears, by the way. Foil Entei Delta Species. Well, Delta Species, I mean Ancient Trade. My bad. Volcarona Hollow. Volcarona, one of my favorite Pokemon. Simply for the fact of the work paid off after I did evolve him during the games. That was pretty cool. The Mewtwo Black Star promo that we got from the last box. The Hollow God of War from the last box, if you remember. That was a very good box. Gavantula Hollow, Glass Hollow from the Battle Decks, the Dual Decks. Now, here's a funny story. This is a Hollow Heatran and a Reverse Hollow Heatran. I pulled them in the same pack. I'm, I'm actually being serious, I pulled them in the same pack. And I wanted to keep them together to commemorate that fact. So yeah, that's why they're together, that's why the reverse holo version isn't with the other reverse ones. Holo Gigalith. Holo Diancy. Diancy I've always been torn on for whatever reason. I don't know. It's just one of those things. Chandelure. Holo. Oh, Chandelure looks boss with that. Would have been even more boss had it the class pattern. But I digress. Talonflame, glass pattern. This was also from the dual decks. And Pyro Hollow. That was also from the decks as well. I botched that. Um, this was from a booster pack, not from the dual decks. Durr. But anyways, yeah, Pyro. And that's my holo collection. Right there. I'm getting a pretty sizable collection of hollows and EXs now. I'm gonna count them in a minute. After this video ends. But anyways. Thank you guys for watching this video. Probably best sent to that. There you go. Thank you guys for watching this video, and I'll see you in the next video, whatever that may be, because this the time between this and the last unboxing was a bit ridiculous. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you back again soon. Laters! Yo, what's up guys? I hope you really enjoyed that video and everything, and I hope you can subscribe to Deadball Dragons, like us on Facebook, 
follow us on Twitter, all the social media, and maybe go on one way or the other because I got it wrong last time, and check out my other videos. But until then, I'll see you later. Peace. I believe in the Pico. I believe in the Pico. I believe in the Pico. Please, Torrance, I you. Please don't sue me. Please, please. <laughs>